World Edit for MCPE 2022. Make sure you turn on Experimental Gameplay and make sure you have the Resource Pack and Behavior Pack activated. First thing you want to do is you want to go to the chat over here and type in slash tag and then your username or you guys could do at P right over here and then press on Add Builder right over here and then it's going to automatically give you that option over here. All right, so the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the chat over here and type out slash give at p or your username and then w e d i t just like so then with a colon right over here and then you will see a bunch of options over here and basically you want to get all of these right over here so i'll be back with you guys once i got the important one i got the paste copy cut spawn glass block redo and undo button right over here and also we need the selection wand which can be found from the creative inventory all right so i'm going to show you how to make paths right now all right so the first thing you want to do is you want to figure out what blocks you want your path to be so i'm going to be making a path with all of these materials right over here so once you went ahead and laid out all the materials do is you actually want to get a shovel of your choice it has to be a shovel guys do not forget that so for this one in particular i'm going to be doing a wooden shovel go to the world edit settings over here and just press on it just like so then you'll see this entirely new menu and what you want to focus on is you want to focus on the brush things over here then go ahead and press on it just like so make sure you select the shovel that you picked previously so previously we picked the wooden shovel so we're going to be picking it right over here then what you want to do is you want to select on the spear brush then you guys can pick how big you want your brush to be we're gonna be doing five over here so once you selected that you will see we have two brushes on the red brush what you want to do is you want to press on the grass just like so and then it will say set max to block grass and then what you want to do is you want to crouch down over here and you actually want to select all these blocks over here so the cobstone the coarse dirt all of these blocks and once you went ahead and done that then you guys can press on the uh, check mark button over here that says done just like so then it's basically going to ask you to confirm it then press on done just like so the check mark and then you guys can exit out this menu now whenever you use your wooden brush as you can tell there is a new path that is made over here it is absolutely insane um i really love how it's all randomized and all that look at that we did that so effortlessly now i'm going to show you how to make spears in minecraft so the first thing you want to do is you want to select a different kind of shovel make sure that it's not the same one you used previously so for this demonstration we're going to be doing the stone shovel then you want to pick out a block that you actually want to make a spear of so place it down just like so once you went ahead and done that what you want to do is you want to go back to your world edit settings then activate it just like so then go to the brush settings once more then go ahead and select the correct uh brush or shovel make sure that it is the same one you chose previously so uh for the spear we did the stone shovel so we're going to be selecting on the stone shovel then go on the spear option right over here all right once you're done with that then you can pick how big you want your spear to be so i'm going to be going with uh, a size of five over here and then once again we have a mask brush and a regular brush so for the mask brush which is the red one what you want to do is you want to look up in the air and literally just press on the air because we're going to be making the mask an air block right over here and once you're done with that then you can take your pattern picker and then just go ahead and crouch down over here make sure you crouch and then press on the block that you want to make a spear of which in this instance we're going to be making a spear out of amethyst so press on the amethyst right over here and once you're done with that then you guys can go ahead and hit on the green check mark that says okay then it is gonna ask you uh you know like a confirmation then press on okay just like so then you guys can exit the menu and whenever you see your new shovel uh you know it's gonna be enchanted and all that and then you guys will be able to actually make full-on spheres and this is really cool look at that boys we literally have amethyst spheres right over here which is just super duper cool we have two useful tools right over here the redo button and the undo button so these will basically reverse any edits that you did make so if you ever made a mistake or anything like that then all you gotta do is just press on this right over here and it is going to undo whatever you did or you guys can redo it over here to basically just forward it so that definitely does give you a lot of freedom all right so the next thing i'm going to show you how to do is how to clear out large chunks of land take your selection one and then what you want to do is you want to crouch and then what you want to do is you want to select on one area over here the starting position which um will actually tell you the coordinates over here and then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and travel until you want to actually clear out your land and then select on the end points right over here 
you will then notice that we get a dotted outline and once you went ahead and selected the area that you want to get make sure you get the cut tool right over here then just press on it just like so and as you can tell we cut most of that area over here it's not a perfect job or anything like that however i do think it gets the job done next up i'm going to show you how to copy and paste structures of your choice in order to start off go to one side of your build over here and just press on it over here with your selection wand over here aka the wooden axe and then just press on it just like so and then we have our first position then what you want to do is you want to go all the way to the back and up of your part and from where you put your first point go ahead and go up and go diagonally towards the end of your build just like so and then what you can do is you can use a spawn glass block over here and this will basically allow you to select another point with your selection wand over here so we're gonna be pressing it just like so and then as you can tell we have a full outline of the house that we want to copy over here and you guys can add more things as well it doesn't necessarily have to be like this house or anything like that once you made an outline of your build just like so go to the center of it or at least try to this appears to be the center so just go on it right over here you want to go ahead and press on it and then it's going to say you copied a certain number of blocks so right now we have 800 blocks copied and once you went ahead and done that then you guys can go to another location and actually paste your build so i think we're going to be pasting it right over here this seems to be about right and then what you want to do is you want to just go ahead and paste it just like so hopefully as you can tell we just pasted our build inside and this is really really cool so obviously it's not perfect or anything like that but we just copied that house over here and we pasted it in another location which in my opinion is pretty cool see you later french fries